Hi, everybody. It's me, Ms. Schwartz. Welcome to week six of my online art room. You folks know my co-host, Ocho the Octopus. So this is a new month, May, and we are going to be shifting our focus as far as what we're going to be doing for projects. The month of April, we made projects out of recyclables like toilet paper tubes and cereal boxes and whatnot. Uh, this project uh, is going to be a lot easier to do. All you're going to need is a piece of paper. You are going to need a pencil, a pen. You can use either. Either works. And if you have uh, markers or other pencils, that's great, or crayons too. If you don't have them, that's okay, but they would certainly uh, help. And if you are going to want to put your project up, you're going to need a little bit of tape. So let me talk to you about our project. If you've been uh, out and about, you may have seen signs in people's windows or people's yards or in signs of uh, businesses or maybe even billboards that have uh, messages of hope. Uh, maybe you've seen ones that say, you know, we will get through this or stay healthy, stay strong. I'm going to pull up some ones that uh, I have seen. Here's one that I, I have seen. It says, we, or excuse me, we're all in this together. That was uh, put in someone's window. This is... This is one that I saw in my neighborhood. Let's uh, blow it up a little bit. It says, you are loved, stay safe. And I thought this one was really clever. Somebody painted the word hope on a barn. Another sign that you probably have seen a lot of uh, are signs with rainbows. People have been putting signs with rainbows on them because the message goes at the end of every storm, there is a rainbow, so to speak. So during this COVID-19 pandemic, we are still waiting for a rainbow and yes, it will arrive. We just need to be patient. Here are some signs that thank first responders. Um, essential workers like, uh, Grocery store workers, delivery uh, delivery people, teachers, um, uh, bus drivers, and whatnot, um, nurses. Thank you, doctors. So uh, this is these signs are giving a shout out to uh, people behind the scenes who are helping everything run smoothly during this pandemic. So here is uh, another sign. There we go. Here is another sign uh, that I snapped up in my neighborhood. Someone had drawn a picture of a rainbow. So that is the kind of um, that's the kind of sign I am looking for. So a sign that thanks uh, essential workers, that sp spreads uh, a message of hope, that reminds people to stay safe, or tells people that they are loved, and you know, or says we will get through this. Now, this is one that I just whipped up really quick. It says, thank you, nurses, delivery people, teachers, doctors, EMTs, and then I drew a little rainbow. And if you don't know what an EMT is, an EMT are those uh, medical workers that rescue people on ambulances. They're the folks who save people's lives on ambulances. So if somebody has to call 911 and an ambulance show up, uh, shows up, the folks working there are EMTs. So I'm going to walk you through what I want to see in this project. I'm going to pull up my Paint 3D. I'm going to click on New. Okay. So I'm going to grab my handy stylus. And I want to say... I feel like saying you are love. So let me. I'm just going to write you are loved.
and oh, I don't know, I will put a little rainbow at the bottom of mine. So here we go. Oops, I think my rainbow might run into my message. Okay, there we go. Okay. Or you can um, you can uh, say thank you, you know. Thank you doctors okay. and you know if you just want to write a message that's fine um, as you can see on this one that uh, I made earlier I made my letters uh, really big you don't want to make some little itty bitty sign that is going to be hard for uh, folks to read you want to make a nice big sign uh, this is a regular size piece of paper, uh, so uh, this will work if you have a bigger piece of paper, that's great. But make sure, you know, people can see the message on your sign. Like if they're uh, walking by your window or whatever and uh, they stop to look, you want to make sure that they uh, are seeing your message. So I'm just going to go ahead and erase everything. So if you don't feel like writing something, that's okay too. All you have to do uh, is draw a picture and it can just be, you know, something uh, really uh, simple like a heart. Okay. Or like, you know, I said, um, it can be a, uh, a rainbow. Oops, we can switch colors. And if you do make one of these signs, I want you to think really hard about uh, what kind of positive message do you want to do you want to send. So. That being, uh, all that being said, save, okay. I have uh, put this lesson up in uh, my online art room. I'm really hoping that we get to do more art together now that uh, all the devices have been distributed. So if you are able to do this project, you can always take a picture and uh, upload it and send it to me. You guys know my email address kshores at kcmsd.net. So I am really looking forward to uh, working with you guys this week. And I want you to know that uh, I miss you. I love you. And I want everybody to take care. Goodbye.